Hello preschool! Welcome to my gardening video. I miss you and I wanted to show you what I've been up to while we've been away. It's a beautiful sunshiny day so I'm glad to be outside today. Do you remember what letter we are working on this week? Can you tell me the letter? If you said V, you're right. Big line down, big line up. V is for vegetables. So that's why I brought you out to my vegetable garden. And I have a special song to do with you today because I love to dance and sing with you and I miss doing that. So I thought I'd do the hokey pokey, the planting plan with you. And it goes like this. You scoop the soil in, you pick the rocks out, you put the seed in and you pat it all about. You add a little water and you wait for it to sprout. That's what it's all about. That's our hokey pokey for planting. Now, before we get started, I wanna show you what you need for planting or for gardening. So I'm gonna show you the tools I use. If you come on down here, you can see my gardening gloves. I put these gloves on, that way, my hand is nice and protected when I dig in the dirt, which is lots of fun. I also have my trowel. A trowel is like a mini shovel and it helps you dig the spot for your seeds and plants. And then don't forget your watering can. This is my watering can because on some days there's just not enough rain, so I need to add some water. Okay, so. Now that you know what we need, let me show you what I've been growing and what I've been up to. Over here are my three tomato plants. One, two, three. And right now, they're just little plants that are little sprouts with leaves. But when they grow taller, when they get more sun and a little more water, they will be larger plants. And then they will have some red, juicy tomatoes. I can't wait for that. That will probably happen in the summer. Okay, now let me show you something else over here. This is my cabbage. My cabbage still has some small leaves, but don't you worry, it will grow into some bigger, greener, gray leaves that will be ready probably for the fall that will get that big right in time for September. And then you might remember that I planted a little baby carrot inside my house. I started with just a little bit of water and I showed you that in another video, right? This is that baby carrot put into a bigger pot. So it will have more room to grow. So you see now I added the soil, I added the dirt and that way it could grow a little bit bigger. And when it gets even bigger, I'll put it right down here into the vegetable garden. They call it a bed, <laughs> kind of because that's where the seeds and the plants sleep under the soil in the bed. Okay, and let me show you. I put some sunflower seeds. My daughters and I love sunflowers, so we want to grow those too, but they're hiding under there. I'm just hoping my groundhog doesn't eat them. We have a groundhog who lives right in my backyard and he likes to come and see what I'm growing and take a nibble. Sometimes the squirrels do too. And over here is a baby cucumber plant. She's very small. But if you give the cucumber lots and lots and lots of water, she will soon turn into a vine, a very squiggly vine, and we can get some cucumbers too that will probably be around this summer. So there's a lots of fun to have in your garden. You can garden and you can grow your own vegetables. You could pick any vegetable you'd like to grow in your garden. Just make sure you have three things that are important. You have the sun, you have the water, and you have some soil and a bed. And then you could do the same thing. So have a lot of fun and take care of your plants after you do plant them. Make sure every day you come out, you give them a little bit of water 
and you see how they've been doing because they're kind of like little babies that need lots of love to grow. I brought my celery out to show you that it's still a little tiny for growing, but as soon as it gets a little bigger, we're gonna add another pop, just like the cabbage and the carrots, and then we'll be ready to grow some celery as well. Then we will have so many delicious vegetables, and we will have so much fun getting those ready and eating them. Have a great day, and don't forget to meet me back on Thursday for Zoom and Friday where we will make another fun video. Bye!